right, so it's pouring rain. We were on like the opposite side of town all day and we come back and it's like pouring rain. I don't know if you can tell, probably not, but it's just coming down like a tsunami. And it's 80 degrees. And it's 81 degrees. Can you hear it? Can you hear it on the roof? Anyway. So apparently the weather likes to change rapidly, like in Reno. So that's familiar, at least. There's an Einstein's here. I got super excited. Because, you know, that's our place. It's our hangout spot. It's our go-to. There's the university. Plenty of all you can eat sushi joints, too. Yes. Super curious how sushi tastes on, in, the, in the Florida area. On the East Coast. On the East Coast, by the ocean. Super curious. Oh, it stopped raining. I mean, it's like sprinkling, but <laughs> apparently the cloud is behind us now. Interesting. You keep it rolling, showing the neighborhood that we're in. Yeah. So we're about to turn onto Fletcher, which Speaking is. Speaking of turns, all we fucking did all day was wait to turn left. All day. All day. All day. It takes you. It takes you like a half an hour to grow like eight miles in this town because there's no protected left turns like they're all like pray pray to god and just go for it and as soon as we get through a left turn we get a red light like the one we're sitting at right now yeah and they last forever <laughs> and they're like hanging on wires they're not on poles i'm assuming that's for like hurricane reasons for the mexican children what oh to throw their shoes upon oh i'll throw that so there's the University of South Florida. You see how fucking flat this place is too. So flat. Oh. And it's raining again. That's so that's cool. Morton University. So loud. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And like now that. it's not. Just like <laughs> it's that. sprinkling again. <laughs> Are we going to turn right into it? Yes. Way. I think so. Yes. <laughs> We're still getting used to their surrounding streets. I've only been here for 12 hours. What do you want from me? Everything. Everything. That's a lot. I want everything! That's so much. So we went to the facility today, and uh, I talked to one of the guys out front to see if they'd let me in. He said, yeah, go on in, but you know, I didn't say you could. Like, I, I don't know nothing about it. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it was a hard hat area. Yeah. Because they're still working. But I'm going to go in tomorrow with a guy, a gentleman named Larry Powell who works for the company. And, uh... Learn. Gonna he's going to learn how to set up the racks. Yeah, I can't just bring ten people in there and be like, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know. I don't know. Start the door. Start the door. Start the door. Gizmo's still hiding. Yeah, Gizmo's a lump in the bed because he's hiding under the blankies. Whoa, dear. So much greenery. Greenery. So what we did today, baby, we went to Target. Oh, we did so much today. I'm so tired. So first we went, first the guy came and installed the washer and dryer. And then we went to Target. No, we went to Starbucks right Oh yeah, the we went to, oh we went, we had lunch at a sub place right across the street, which was really good. And then we had Starbucks. And then we went to Target. And then we went to Ross. We got a toaster oven. We got toaster oven. And a couple bowls. Some bowls, some hangers. And then we left. 
And then we left. Okay. Then we went to Ross and I got a bathing suit and a couple bras because, yeah, girls need bras. And then after Ross, we went to the Sears outlet. We got there, yeah, we went there right after. We went oh, to, no, actually, we went to Target. We filled your prescription. We filled my prescription and at Target. Card was denied. Oh, right. Yeah, so, yeah, we were, Matt was stuck on the phone for probably a good half an hour trying to get my card b- turned back on because they were like, oh, we don't understand, man, me. And, because, like, it worked at Starbucks, and then, like, 20 minutes later, I tried using it at Target, and it was denied. It's like, what the hell? What the hell, man? So, after we got my car turned back on, then we went to the Sears outlet, and we're sorely disappointed, because everything was really expensive, and they didn't really have that much there. And then, after that, we went to, uh, what's that, the K? Oh, Kmart. Kmart. And we didn't find anything there. Yeah, I'm starting to understand why they're going out of business. Yeah. And then we went to Petco, didn't get anything there, went back to Target because, like, everything that we had looked at was cheaper at Target, so we had to go back to Target. And then we went to Publix, checked it out, spent 100 bucks on groceries, so now we're, like, broke. And now we're on our way home. And it's, like, every, oh, we went to the facility before we did any of that. So, yeah, before we went to Target the first time. So, we've been, like, running around. It's 6.52, and we've been out since noon. <laughs> Just waiting for the Just freaking in traffic the whole freaking time. The entire day. In the entire day. So annoying. So, we you are... Can, you can definitely tell when you... Entered the bad part of town. Oh, uh, definitely. It's, it's obvious. Like you just know. You, just, you know when you when you've been around the world as much as I have. <laughs> pretentious. Been in so many different places. So been, pretentious. You 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 know you get this vibe that just just comes at you from from the world, the trees, the, like that bike. There's a bike. Everything on around you. you just it just clicks. You're like whoa. Whoa. There's some bad shit that happened. There's here. this is a bad neighborhood. It's a bad area. Yeah. Oh, it stopped raining. Again. Oh. Water. 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 So we are coming up on our apartment complex. Do you see the area around it's Yeah, this is the area around. There's like a, a telecom communications place, like a little business association center or whatever. Like a mini Silicon Valley. And we are about to pull in to our... No. I lied. <laughs> There's this shell station on the left there where the guy didn't believe me that I was 23. He's like, do you have another ID? Like, so oh, I'm like, so like, after we literally just told him that we moved here today, or yesterday. Like, do you want to go check my license plate? Yeah. Do I fucking look like I'm under so here's the front office to our apartment complex. Let me, let me it's that up beautiful. Oh, thank you so much. So beautiful. So that's where our mailbox and everything is. I don't remember our mailbox number. 1501? Sure? Or 1531. It's on a piece we'll of paper that we have. We'll out, I'm sure. Is this person gonna. Yeah, oh, calling he's somebody. calling. We forgot to look at phones. We'll do it on Friday. Yeah. Next Friday when we have more money. Having no money is stressful. Especially when you just moved to a new state and, and you need and things. The reason why you're broke is because of a thousand dollar mistake you made. Yeah. Which, I mean, it's not like we lost that money. It's just that we don't, we, currently, have we it. don't currently have it. It's being like, it's like we can't touch it. Like it's like a savings bond that you give to a child. Child, exactly. <laughs> Beep, and the gate opens for us because we're awesome. There was a neighborhood kitty hanging out on one of the staircases earlier. He was very cute. What is this person doing? doing? It's my turn to go, asshole. Yeah. I'm gonna just park on the other side of the gate so we can't get in. There's a crane. 
What are you doing? He shouldn't be doing that. Yeah, well. He might have a gun, he might shoot you. I might have a gun, I might shoot him. But you don't. He doesn't know that. True. This is the apartment complex. It's pretty. And we live like way in the back corner. Is where our building is. This over here is like a lake. Like it's a bunch of water. I'm hoping there's crocodiles. I'm hoping there's gators in there. I, I have yet to see a gator. See I was here. promised there would be gators here and Not I haven't good. seen one. I'm kind of disappointed about that. Right? Sure. I don't even know. It's all the same. It's a big loop. It's a big loop. Yeah. I think she was singing. There's a couple of policemen that live in this apartment complex. One police. One sheriff. police, one sheriff, excuse me, to be exact. You oh, think there's, there's vacuums and stuff that we can use to get turn that way. Car too. Turn that way. Is he following us? Writing again, yay! So this is our building right here to the left and we live on the third floor. Floor, which is the top floor. Parking is pretty much anywhere you can find as long as it's like first come first serve and you can't block anybody's garage. So we just have like, we just bought a crap ton of stuff and now we have to carry it in the rain. <laughs> Yay! This is only 80 degrees. Yeah. Alright, so here we are. We're gonna there's this on the top floor there. We're gonna head inside. Wait for the rain to stop. Alright, peace out, man.